There are three things genetically we find in almost all kids on the spectrum, okay? Maybe four. Number one, we find out that their immune systems tend to be aggressive and they have trouble turning the immune system off. The second thing we found in 100% of kids on the spectrum is an autophagy issue, which means they have insulin resistance tendencies. They have trouble getting enough glucose into their cells in order to make enough energy through the mitochondria. So that's why a lot of these kids crave carbohydrates and sugars. And then the third thing we find in almost all of them is a methylation deficiency in, in most of them. And that can be anywhere, not just the MTHFR gene, it can be anywhere in the pathway. And so you really have to look at the entire pathway to know whether that's an issue. And then now with us knowing that about According to research, 70% of these kids have a folate receptor autoantibody in the nervous system, too. That makes it even more important for us to get the methylation. 70%? 71%. That's what the most recent study showed us. And so um, that's, that's in children on the spectrum.